Vernon Stagg says he was heading back into work when he heard the gunshots and realized the shooting was close by. He told me he was in shock. It's not like you see on TV. You don't go running. You freeze. Stagg says the Walmart parking lot was full and everyone was in pure disbelief. I froze right when it happened. Our customers froze right when it happened. You're just staring and you're trying to convince yourself you're not seeing what you're seeing. Because I, I saw the police cars and I saw the smoke, but I'm thinking, oh, a car is on fire. You're thinking, you know, a fireworks are going off. You're doing all these things to try to convince yourself you're not seeing what you're actually seeing. But his mind wasn't playing tricks on him. He was actually witnessing multiple shots being fired right next to his work. I could see them ducking and weaving uh, in this general area, kind of ducking and weaving behind their cars. And, um, and then you could just see the smoke and you could see the ricochets coming off the mall over here. Stagg says he will forever be grateful for the heroic officers and fears what would have happened if the shooter got any closer. They stopped him 100 feet from Walmart. You know, what would have happened if he would have gotten there and, and done something terrible, you know? So, I mean, we really owe a, a, a debt of gratitude to Sheffield, to Muscle Shells and all the surrounding police. Um, I don't know what we'd have done without him. Stagg says he heard so many gunshots he had to check himself to make sure no stray bullets hit him. But thankfully, law enforcement did everything they could to make sure they were keeping the community safe. Reporting in Muscle Shoals, Grace Campbell, Way 31 News.